we present neural metamaterial networks for nonlinear material design. Thanks to their programmable microstructures, mechanical metamaterials boast a wide range of macroscopic properties. However, finding structure parameters that lead to an ideal approximation of high-level performance goals is challenging. In this example, we aim to solve the inverse problem of finding structures that satisfy given strain-stress target profiles for different regions of a shoe cushion. A natural approach to solving this problem is to optimize over native-scale simulations. Changing a material's structure parameters, however, will entail changes in the simulation meshes, and there will inevitably be singular points at which mesh topology must change to accommodate changes in geometry. These topology changes, and the corresponding discontinuities in simulation derivatives, are challenging the robustness of gradient-based optimization methods. To address the aforementioned challenges, we propose neural metamaterial networks, or NMN, neural networks that model the nonlinear macromechanical behavior of entire metamaterial families. For a given set of variables defining the material's microstructure, we perform simulations on the periodic patches to obtain macromechanical descriptions of our metamaterials. With the simulation data in hand, we use deep neural networks to learn a differentiable energy density function whose derivatives best approximate the stress-strain data obtained from the simulation. With a smooth map from parameter to performance space that is fully differentiable, we formulate inverse material design as a nonlinear programming problem that leverages neural networks for both the objective functions and the constraints. We demonstrate a potential application of customized shoe cushion design with desired performance profile for different regions shown on the left. Starting from an initially homogeneous hexagonal layout, our approach successfully arrives at optimized structures that not only satisfy the nonlinear profile but also provide visually pleasing patterns. Instead of prescribing a particular strain stress behavior in a given direction, we can also specify directional stiffness profiles. Here we show an example of matching a target stiffness profile. As can be seen from the resulting structure, the beams change their orientation to match the prescribed highly anisotropic target. Complementing the previous example for stiffness design in the direction of loading, we now turn to lateral coupling in terms of Poisson's ratio. As can be seen in this example, the optimized structure successfully turns a high-frequency profile into an isotropic one. For details regarding the optimization method and more examples please refer to the paper. Our method removes the need for native-scale simulation and re-meshing at design time providing smoother behavior of macromechanical properties across parameter space compared to simulation-based methods with meshing in the loop. Here we examine this smooth behavior on a concrete example of matching a set of target points along a strain-stress curve for uniaxial loading for the example shown on the left. We sample the objective function along a given direction in parameter space and compare results obtained through native-scale simulations and our neural representation. When evaluating the design objective based on native-scale simulations, the plot exhibits high-frequency oscillations around a linear trend. To identify the source of this non-smoothness, we overlay the simulation rest state meshes for three consecutive steps in parameter space using a relatively small step size. The close-up views shown here reveal that the change in discretization is rather significant compared to the small magnitude of parameter perturbations. Although our neural representation is trained on mesh-based simulations, it does not require meshing in the loop and thus produces smooth behavior across parameter space. We examine this metamaterial unit where a single parameter controls the size of the inner square. Our neural metamaterial network provides a smooth representation even at the singularity point. Thank you for watching.